This is the best of Wake Up Carolina. My daughter had a birthday party, and we thought it would be fun. What do you? We thought it I'm, would I'm, be I'm fun laughing because I know the story to have a pony come to the birthday party, but the pony was unavailable. The pony was spoken for. The pony had um, a prior commitment. So my cousin, who is in the exotic animal business, said, "But I've got a zebra I can bring." And I said, "Andy." Zebras can be rambunctious, can't they? No, no. This thing's docile and quiet and calm. In fact, just to secure that, I got a veterinarian friend of mine. And we'll give, because zebras are real muscular. I mean, they, they, they are. They're, they're working out. I mean, if you ever, well, I mean, I had up close and personal. We'll get there in a second. <laughs> so, um, so anyway, the, the, the pony's unavailable. I didn't tell my wife, I don't think, until the last second. My wife said, that pony has stripes. <laughs> that's not a pony. That's a zebra. Can't put these other people's children on a zebra. You fool. <laughs> I said, hey, listen, it was, uh, I mean, the, the, we had some, uh, just some commitment conflicts. The, the, the zebra has been treated. The zebra has been medicated. The, the zebra will be more fun to ride. I mean, how many kids can go home and tell their parents they rode a zebra? And the kids are like, zebra, 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 hold it right to zebra, hold it right to zebra. <laughs> so the veterinarian had already administered the medication. And we get the zebra out of the, um, out of the trailer. And he's kind of wild-eyed. I mean, he really is. And, and he begins getting rambunctious to the point of stomping in the air. So I turn around because I'm about to give my wife warning. This ain't going like I thought it was going to go. So let's get the kids in safe places. Well, she's already doing that. And it's not just her. It's the parents of all these other children. They're, they're, they're rolling under cars. They're jumping in the windows. They're, they're running across the yard. Well, my cousin and I, the fearless leaders that we are, we took the zebra on. And it was in, in, in complete and total dedication to the other humanity that could have potentially been in harm's way. So we fight the zebra. I mean, literally, we fought the zebra as if we were fighting another human being. And it took both of us. And we were losing for a long time. And we finally get the zebra tied up to the side of the trailer. You've seen the evidence. Mm -hmm. There is put a the picture. Ev put the evidence into car, son. <laughs> Am I right? You're right. You've seen the evidence yep. of the, the defeated zebra tied beside the trailer. Now, he was a handful. I mean, he was a double handful. He knocked my cousin down with his neck and head. He, he reared up like he was going to stomp on me, and I kind of gave him some space, and I fell down. And I can remember looking up going, this crazy thing is getting ready to stomp me to death. So I got holes in my jeans. My cousin's got blood running off his elbows. We're both out of breath. <laughs> we got other people looking now like, this guy's making it. No, I'm not making it up at all. So, so anyway, he looks at me. You okay? I said, Damn, Bo. <laughs> you said the zebra got medicated, man. Well, we found out after the fact that the 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 veterinarian was not completely certified. He was not oh, no. his license had been revoked. He uh -oh. had some he had some issues. And he'd given the wrong medication. And he'd given a medication that had the exact opposite effect of what it was intended, and instead of making the zebra, you know, nonchalant and lackadaisical it hot the zebra up to the point that he was in a i mean we were in a fight for our lives but i can remember looking up laying on the ground because i'd already been knocked down and i'm holding this rope in my hand you know because I, I mean I'm, I'm just thinking about those kids and i'm saying if this zebra starts running across there's, there's no telling what happens <laughs> there is so i'm holding the rope and he slings me down on the ground and he's and he's got his paw i mean it was his hoofs up in the air and, and I remember thinking for a second, Rev, I said, this son of a gun's getting ready to stomp me dead in my yard. And we finally, you know, we finally defeat the zebra because that's what we are to do. We, we fail to lose. We refuse to lose. And, um, and, and Rev, seen, Rev has seen the evidence. Here's a picture. And, and, and the zebra, as, as, as valiantly as he tried, he was a defeated um, safari animal in Evergreen, South Carolina, <laughs> halfway between Florence and Pamplico. On a farm that I lived on. So there's the uh, so there's the zebra story. There's the zebra story. And, and we will have to repeat it once we expand into the onto the new stations. And there's no exaggeration. I mean, if you'd been there, I mean, my wife will tell. That's that's not a that pony has stripes. 
I said, well, no, 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 no. We, we had a scheduling conflict, yeah, yeah. Trust, but, trust. But, but we got this. And then it gets worse and worse. Then we find a veterinarian didn't really have his license and the medication. I, I guess he didn't have his reading glasses, and he gave him a shot, a shot of something else. And, and I just picture the parents and the kids scattering, running for their lives. Well, that's exactly what they were doing. <laughs> that's exactly what they were doing. And I'm going to tell you, I contemplated hero or not. And there was a second that I said, uh, these six-year-olds on their own. <laughs> <laughs> Because I'm seeking shelter, my friend, because I don't think I can handle any more of this. What did Jerry Clover say? Should have been here amongst us. One of us got to have some relief. Uh, I, I was almost These six-year-olds are on their own. Well, it, I didn't quite go there. But for a second, save myself <laughs> and, let, and let everybody else fend for themselves. But but being the hero, you know, and, and being uh, the, the, the ever-giving person that I tend to be. It was their safety as the as the priority.